Good morning guys, Zach Sanders with the Dotson Ski Z channel. It's currently sunny and beautiful out here in California on my third day out here. I'm just kidding, obviously it's raining. Kind of makes me sad, but I'm going to Left Coast Dotson to meet up with my buddy Chuck. Uh, not my buddy, I, this will be my, the first time I get to meet him, but I'm pretty excited because he's got some 510s in the garage that I'm pretty excited about. And it should be a great trip. I'm, I'm just excited to see his garage, what he has going on. Then after that, I should be going home tonight back to Colorado. And it was a good trip out here to California to see a couple of great cars that I love, especially the Dotson lifestyle. And yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's get on the way to the shop so I can uh, show you guys what's going on. All right, well, made it to Left Coast Dotson. Um, we're kind of in Long Beach right now, but whew, it's raining and it's cold. Let's see what uh, see what Chuck has in store for us. Good. And we basically just test fit it, then we gotta yank it out, build all the mounts, and then frickin' we're gonna paint the engine bay, weld the new front clip on, paint the interior of the car, reassemble. Nice, that'll look really good. He's gonna leave the outside patina and just clear coat it. That'd be sweet, yep. That's kind of what I wanna do with my Z, so. 
this we'll one we did a motor swap in about four months ago five months ago nice it uh, looks loves the way it runs and drives uh brought it back for a complete suspension yep so we're that doing makes, foil that makes front sense. and rear big brakes front and rear sway bars new bushings wow another customer 1975 710 uh, he brought it to me. It was kind of in pieces, so we got it running. None of the wiring was hooked up. We eliminated wow. a lot of the bullshit. Freaking that looks so good. Got it running, driving. We drove it 100 miles two weekends ago for two events, and the fucking radiator took a shit. So it's time to... So, yeah, I have a brand new radiator for it. I put a new water pump, new radiator. That looks good. Wow, that looks... That paint job is solid. Nice. That car's from Mexico, the, the yellow... Years ago in 76 they did that four wheel drive wow and uh so he didn't have the motor and tranny in it so the city told him you either move the truck or we're going to charge you 200 uh, 2500 bucks what so he called me and asked me if i can install store here for motor. a little bit well install the motor tranny get it running fix the brakes clean the tank all the basic stuff cool that's a 1960 dotson truck that's a give you the tour real fast oh yeah that's my shop truck. That's my 300. That's my 1200. That's my 510. This is your side. This is a customer's car here. Wow, that's cool. I like that. I like that brown on that. Yeah. 1200 with a freaking. Nice. And these, I don't have time to work on my cars. So when it's I find hard. them, I buy them and I just stash them back here. And then people see them and they want to buy them. So I just. Sometimes I don't have to do nothing. To do them. you get rid of them sometimes? Yeah. yeah I sell them when they want them. 1600, that's nice. My buddy had an SR, so white SR swap on that. In a 620? Yeah. What is this? This is a 70, uh, 521 uh, SR turbo motor. There's no hood, so I gotta keep it covered. Yeah, it that's get fair. All wet. 70 what? Oh, this is your paint shop. Nice. Paint shop, but it, works. it works. It does the job. Wow. Yeah. This is a 68 two door that I'm almost done with. I just bought a brand new fucking $600 paint gun yesterday so I can do the base coat clear coat. Wow. That looks good. I had Sweet. A, this whole fucking. I totally forgot. Like, this is the stock 68 hole for the antenna. And the people that built this car in the past had fucking sealed it. So I had to drill the hole back. And now I gotta go in and do a little bit of body work, work on it. This. Yeah. And then I can spray the car because the sides are done, roof's done, hood's done, trunk's done, fenders are done. Wow. It's just, yeah, I'm, I'm almost there. Sweet. Looks good. Engine bay's already painted, got that out of the way so I don't have to deal with it. The blue? Spray both of those with just base coat to get an idea of what color. Yeah. It's gonna be the last one? The right one. The right one? Yeah, he likes okay. that right color, the lighter color. This one's more of a turquoise. I like that. You're so cute. Chuck and I are heading over to LHADM. We're gonna go and check out some... Motors. Motors, some cool motors. I'm pretty excited, so this is gonna be pretty dope. We're, we're talking about um, how Chuck got started with the Datsuns and, and what really got him going with, uh, you know, 510s and all this other good stuff. So tell me a little bit about what got you started, man. Well, back in the 80s, I was living with my parents in North Long Beach, probably 82, 83, and I had a 1957 oval window bug, and it was nice, it was lowered, Porsche orange, uh, stock steelies, chromed out little single port motor, cool little bug, ragtop, and these guys that lived just a mile or so away from me used to 
come by the house and throw revs at me. And this is the 80s when street racing was really, you know, popular fun. and it's safe. Still fun. Somewhat safer than so, what it is now. And it's crazy now. There's a, I don't know, it's a respect thing for the streets. I don't know. But anyways, moving on. Freaking, these guys come by my house throwing revs on my bug all the time. Bam, bam, bam. Like, what do you want? They go, you want to race that stuff? They said shit, but you know. I said, yeah. Let's race. So we go down the street, we race, wah, 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 back and forth, back and forth. It was a good little race. I mean, I didn't have but maybe a 1700 Volkswagen motor, and he was probably running a Datsun L18 or something with some side drafts. It was a good race. Go back to my house. They hit me up. Hey, we're partying tonight. You want to go to a party with us? I'm like, sure. And I had just met these guys. I'd seen them around, but just met them. I'm like, yeah, I'm down. They go, well, meet us at our house down the street, you know, tonight at 7. I said, well, I'm going to leave my car. You guys can get me. All right, all right. Come got me. We went to like four or five different parties that night. Rage cage. All of us got arrested. <laughs> First night I meet these guys, we all get arrested. I got lucky and my buddy that I had just met, his mom bails me out of jail. Doug barely even knew me. He told his mom, hey, you gotta get my friend out. He's cool, he was with us, he's down, let's get him out. So, long story short, they bailed me out. I moved in with them, lived with them for shit. 12 years, 15 years, and Dotsons were just a big part of his life. His name was Brian. His family or whatever. And Joe, well, his mom was just a single parent. He had a younger sister, and him and his friends were just into Dotsons. And as I hung out more with them, there was 30, 40 guys that had Dotson 510s and other, you know, sorts of Dotsons, pickup trucks, you know, little this and little that. And it just became a lifestyle, a daily lifestyle, yeah. Yeah, a hobby, you know, because we all had cars. I'll have the same, roughly the same car, the same brand of car, at least. We'd, we'd right? yeah, we'd go f from party to party every weekend with our Datsuns, you know, 10, 15, 20 cars deep, 30 people packed in the back seats, just drinking, cruising. drinking Boone's Farm. Remember, <laughs> uh, you might be too young, but some of I these am, people I know am. what Boone's Farm is. Uh, 99 cents a bottle. We'd get that stuff by the case. And, <laughs> It was just, again, it was a lifestyle. People, Dotsons back then weren't as popular to certain individuals as they are today. Dotsons are a Look at that. Toyota. Look at that. Look at that. Whee! <laughs> Old school. Yeah, Dotson. well, big thing about uh, Dotsons and, you know, 240s, 510s, they're all, like, they're all coming back. Like, the, the lifestyle is, like, coming back. You know, I feel that, um, you know, probably, like, five, six years ago, you can pick up a Z for couple hundred bucks no problem but now it's like you Thousands. can't you can't pick one up for like a thousand you know like a thousand bucks barn finds you bar fight, yeah, barn there, fight. but it's yeah fun. how long how long have you been at the shop i moved into the shop uh almost three years ago so left coast dots and you started three years ago yeah yeah so you started left coast dots and three years ago and you've had you've had a lot of it looks it, it looks like you've had a lot of success a lot of cars in there a b there's a lot of good looking cars in there like he does great work like it's like his work is like no joke it's super clean um you know and uh i think that you know if you're around in this what is it where are we at long beach long beach, long beach area uh y'all need to stop by and at least just check out the shop uh check out left coast dotson uh chuck here he does a fantastic job on all of his dots and stuff uh he, you know he, he does anywhere from z's to to trucks to mainly 510s right you yeah, mainly do 510s 510s is this thing maybe i might have to hit him up for a 510 someday and have him have it shipped out to colorado because uh i would love to have that so maybe an sr swap 510 with uh with a nice fat turbo on it <laughs> but uh that would be that would be my overall goal overall goal in the future maybe you know if, it's definitely it's all about meeting people and, and 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 figuring out their lifestyle and what they're about and and chuck here he has a great lifestyle i love how he's just like super laid back super chill dude he loves dotsons he loves nissans and he just he loves working on cars and making them the best that they can be so um if you uh like the video go down comment subscribe like it do what you can do. I know you got. He's, <laughs> check out Left Coast Dotson. Che Don't check out Left name. Coast Dotson. I will leave that down in the description below where you can uh, find him or how you can contact him. Maybe like his Facebook page or his Instagram page. And you can check out all that stuff. So stay tuned. Dotson Skeezy channel. Left Coast Dotson. We're out of here. See ya.